Mr. Mr. Mayor, opening statement, Coach. Yeah, I thought I was really proud of our guys' effort. Um, I thought uh, Wake was really good to start the game, especially in the first five minutes of the game. I thought they were really good in the last five minutes of the game. When you do that, you give yourself an opportunity to win. You got to give them credit for that. Um, I thought in between that, our guys really fought. I thought in the second half, uh, you know, we got 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 in a lot of foul trouble because of that. We were not uh, able to be as aggressive as we would like, especially in the half court. Um, and so for us, um, you know, we got to be able to try to find a way to win games when we can't do that. We didn't do that. Wake did a good job defending this, uh, and we just we didn't get much there in. Uh, you know, in the way of scoring in the last last few minutes. But I have to line a lot. I mean, 70 free throws between both teams. Um, that's, a, that's a lot of standing and watching, uh, you know, at the free throw line. So, uh, but I'm proud of our, our guys. Um, I thought we, we tried to follow the plan. Um, I thought, thought Tejon gave us some great minutes. So, you know, just a, you know, for us being on the road in the ACC, if you want to try to win a game like that, you got to be better down the stretch. And uh, we weren't quite good enough, but proud of our guys' effort. Questions? How, how difficult was it for your guys to match up with somebody like Sean D. Brown, number 23, and Olivier Saar, number 30? I tell you, uh, I tell you what, I was impressed with Sean D. on, uh, on film. Uh, more impressed with him live. He's a heck of a play, plays hard. You know, if you love basketball, you respect a guy like that. Uh, he, he was. You know, we're like make we're, we're uh, subbing guys in the game to try to, to block him out on a free throw, so that kind of tells you the respect that we had. It, it, tough, um, you know. We, we started five sophomores tonight. It's a great lesson for them on if you want to try to go on the road and beat a team, uh, you know, like Wake Forest. Those are plays that you got to make, and you got to make a guy like him uh, miss more than twice. Uh, because he was uh, 6'8 from the field, 11 11 from the free throw line, had 11 rebounds, the best player on the floor tonight. Uh, and so, uh, yeah, really impressed with his game. Tough matchup for us, um, but uh, good player. After seeing how close Columbia came the other night, how much confidence did you guys have coming in here that you could win the That game had nothing to do with it. You know, uh, we don't really focus on uh, what other teams do, we just focus on ourselves. Uh, you know, our, our goal is always to try to be the aggressors for more minutes than the other team. Um, obviously, watched the, the Columbia game, and they, they had a great game plan. Ours was kind of like 180% different uh, than theirs. And so, uh, but neither's right, neither's wrong. I thought they executed it to a T, had an opportunity to win the game. But, you know, I think it was tied with, with seven and a half to go. I mean, we can't ask for much more. If you'd asked me that before the game, I'd have signed up for that, you know. Uh, is there seven days in a week? Seven days a week, twice on Sunday, as they say. So, but we just got we got to close the game better, you know. And uh, I'm proud of our guys for that. And we got down what 16, I think, yeah. in the second half, in the first half, to fight back. And uh, it was a one possession game there until gave them that dunk at the end. Um, you know, for us being the youngest team in the country last year, uh, being you know, two of your first three on the road at, at uh, Tennessee and Wake. Proud of our guys' effort, but Columbia, um, you know, again, it's, we just try to, you know, I worked for a guy named Shock Smart, and it was, it was always you say, it's just about us, man. It ain't about what the other team does. We can focus on ourselves, get our guys ready to play, then I believe in our guys enough. So, but uh, Wake's good, man. They're, they're a good team, and uh, they, they sure showed it in the last eight minutes. Anything else? Okay, thank you very much. Sweet. Thanks, guys. Great.